Moin, I'm Catherine and today I'm in bed with Emily. Hello. AKA Tusks. And we're at the Reaperband Festival. Yes, yeah. Have you ever been before? No, this is my first time. Oh, but have you been to Hamburg before? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've played here a couple of times actually. I think this is my fourth time playing here. Oh, awesome. Um, yeah, with like different supports um, and previous tours and stuff. But yeah, yeah this is the first time playing Reaperband Festival. Oh, very nice. Yeah. When did you arrive? We arrived a couple of days ago actually because we had a gig in Berlin. So we've had two days here. Um, oh. in Riverbahn, so feeling a bit tired. So did you but, already have <laughs> a few shows? Yeah, I saw Feist, um, mm. and then yesterday we were just sitting on the sort of the main rectangle bit, mm-hmm. just sort of like watching the sessions and stuff, the enjoy sessions. So that was awesome. all good. Anyone yeah. you discovered that you didn't know before, that you were like, oh? Um, no, I don't think so. I think I was kind of picking people that I wanted to go and, yeah, okay, to go and yeah. see, but um, sure. hopefully I'll discover some people today. Yeah. Awesome. What else happened last night? Um... <laughs> Well, we were we were waiting to hear if someone was going to drop out of the Enjoy showcase because I think we were sort of on backup, and mm-hmm. so it just resulted in me and my drummer drinking from <laughs> about <laughs> twelve till nine. Um, oh, okay. So yeah, that's pretty much. And then yeah, we were just sitting in the middle bit, uh, met quite a lot of people, um, watched some sessions. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and then I decided to come home to come here bright and early in the morning. Yeah, <laughs> I think my band stayed out until about. Four, but okay <laughs> we'll see what tonight's like <laughs> yeah i mean after the show you know it's like you can do whatever you yeah do. or do you have anything lined up tomorrow we've got a show oh no we've got a show tonight tonight yeah yeah, yeah so yeah. no we haven't got anything yeah. tomorrow that's very good but are you going to sleep tonight uh i think i might have to drive the van tomorrow home so i should probably sleep a little bit a little, a little, <laughs> yeah a little, a little bit. so um let's start with the random questions okay do i go with you yeah Ooh. oh nice one big spoon or little spoon both I like yeah. them both. Probably little, but then also both. Awesome. <laughs> Excessive. You're very good at writing. <laughs> if you could choose whomever you want, who should write a lullaby for you? Oh, wow. Probably Sampha. Yeah? Yeah. His voice is just... Okay. Yeah, definitely Sampha. What keeps you from sleeping? My boyfriend snoring. Hi. <laughs> 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 Did you ever dream in a dream? Yes, yeah, I have done that. I've yeah. dreamt in a dream and also I have had dreams where I'll wake up from the dream and then a couple of nights later go back into the same dream. And then like before. at the same moment or something? Or no, something? so say like if I have a specific dream on like Tuesday night, I can then go back into that dream on like Friday night and continue on the dream. You, you, so you continue, you start again at the moment you, that it stopped. The, yeah, it's almost like going back to like the same film set or something. It's really strange. That um, is really strange. I've never heard that before. Actually. Yeah, it's really weird. Um, but yeah, I think I have jumped in a dream before as well. Awesome. Some weird dreams. No, boring. <laughs> Too, too similar, too similar. What does your dream bed look like? Uh, when I was younger, I always wanted one of those sleigh beds. You know, the ones that are like, they're kind of like curved at the end. And they're like, okay. kind of like how you'd yeah. imagine the bed that like Santa Claus sleeps in. Yeah. Yeah, so that would be a cool bed actually. Oh, yeah. cool. <laughs> What's the longest you've ever been without sleep? Oh, um, I went to Outlook Festival. Um, Where was that? Outlook Festival's in Croatia. It's like okay. a lot of dance music and stuff. And... It wasn't without sleep, but I think we generally got about two hours sleep a night for like six days. Oh. And that was, yeah, I wouldn't be able to do that anymore. I feel like when you're in your early 20s, you yeah. can go without sleep you, a you lot can do more. It. Yeah, yeah. Absolutely. Um, yeah, But that was probably that, yeah. yeah. When was that? That's too similar. <laughs> <laughs> Starting to read them. Ah, no. What's your favourite sleeping position? <laughs> so, I actually went and bought my first mattress the other day, and the woman asked me that question. She was, yeah. like, what she was like, can you get into your sleeping position? And it's kind of embarrassing, because it looks like I've just fallen off a skyscraper, because I kind of <laughs> sleep with, like, my leg up here and my arm, like, underneath and stuff. So it's kind of, yeah, it's kind of weird. It's like... It's like half and, and on you had front, to do half... that in the shop. Yeah, and she yeah. was like, get into your sleeping position on this bed, and it will work out the weight distribution. And I was like... Okay. <laughs> but yeah, it's um it's sort of a, a weird side, front, leg up, arm down kind of thing. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know if there's a name for it. <laughs> you should come up with a name for it and write a song about it. Yeah. No. <laughs> Stupid question. We should sort out the questions I don't yeah. like. Too similar? <laughs> I like this guy. Do you have a notebook beside your bed? Um, Not purposefully. If I okay. do, I've just left it there from somewhere okay. else. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm not really much of a night. Writer. Right. Okay. <laughs> Fair. Other days, you just want to pull a blanket over your head and just stay in bed. Yeah, I'm an awful morning person, especially when I'm tired. Yeah, we went out, we went out um, 
and had quite a big one on Wednesday night and then I had mm-hmm. to get up for a meeting at 10. And it was one of those things where I woke up and I was like, I don't actually think I can do this. I don't yeah. actually think I can move. Yeah. <laughs> like, that happened to me this morning. Everything. I was like, yeah, I just, I really hate it. Like, especially, you know, when you wake up at like two or something in the morning, it's like, I don't go traveling or something or get mm-hmm. on a plane. That initial feeling of just like, yeah, <gasps> like, yeah, yeah, I'm awful. I'm yeah. the worst person for it. Yeah. <clears throat> Top three people you would not mind being caught in bed with by the paparazzi. <laughs> uh, Tom Hardy. Um, oh God. Three Tom Hardys? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> I think of anyone else but Tom Hardy. The best answer ever. Three Tom Hardys. Best answer ever. <laughs> uh, let's do one more. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> When was your last pillow fight? Um, probably in the last year. Yeah. 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 With whom? Uh, I think it was my boyfriend. Yeah. 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 It was him. Obviously. <laughs> because he was snoring too much. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. It, probably, it probably wasn't a nice pillow fight. It was probably quite malicious. But <laughs> <laughs> um, last question. And for the answer, you can either go to your childhood or deep shit. Okay. Which monster sleeps under your bed? Ooh, I actually had really bad insomnia um, until I was like 20. And so I think it was like the fear of not sleeping yeah. is what kept me awake yeah. when I was a kid. And especially when my parents used to go to bed and they'd like turn the landing light off. And then I'd be like, panic, because now I know I'm not going to go to bed because they've gone to bed and I haven't fallen asleep yet. So yeah, I was yeah. like such a bad sleeper. I had to sleep like in each room in the house for a couple of hours and then I'd wake up and be like, oh, I can't really? sleep. Yeah, yeah, it was really, really bad. Oh, that's bad. And then for yeah. some reason, when I just turned 21, it just... Went the it, other it way, just, and now I'm just like, cannot get enough of sleep. So I it just it. happened? You just because you didn't do anything specific to get rid of it? No, it just happened. No, it just happened. It was really strange. It was literally, I think, I graduated from university and then just could just sleep. So maybe it just was the fucking anxiety of graduating and stuff or something? I mean, I did music for uni, so it was quite nice. <laughs> quite pleasant. <laughs> <laughs> um, no, I don't know what it was. I think, yeah, I don't know. But but either, either way, it went, yeah. lucky, lucky, it just went away. Yeah, yeah, but actually now I'm the other side, but now yeah. I can't get up. So. <laughs> yeah, but that's more, way more healthy than yeah, not yeah, being able to sleep. Yeah, <laughs> <Sorry>. yeah. <laughs> Thank you so, so much. Thank you for having me. And let's say bye to the internet. Goodbye. Bye. bye. bye.